my name is Rosemary Cross. Everybody just calls me Rosie. Um, my husband and I are the youth directors here at Central, and our youth had some questions they wanted to ask you. So here we go. Hey, Miriam. My name is Poe Webster, and I'm a part of Central's youth group. And sometimes things get a little rowdy or sometimes broken, or someone might put bubble bath in the fountain. My question is, how would you handle these harmless acts? Thank you so much for putting all that together and for the excellent questions. Uh, so I guess I'll just start at the top. Um, when it comes to using a building, I think it's important for buildings to be used when it's safe to do so. Um, and sometimes when we use a building, things happen in the building. Uh, we all know that that is true. It's a great thing to have young people in the church building because that means we have young people in the church and we know, or I know, I believe, that God has been using young people since the very beginning to be a part of ministry in the world. And so y'all are an important part of the church and um, we celebrate that you are with us. That said, uh, should anything ever arise that needs um, special attention or uh, some sort of further conversation, I know that we can work it out. I trust that we will be able to figure out the best way to handle whatever needs to be handled in terms of um, fountains and bubbles. Yes. Hey, Miriam. My name is Leah South, and I'm a part of Central's Youth Group. Every year we go on a mission trip, and we do a lot of great things, like go to the homeless shelter, help the veterans, and even go to a baseball game. But we also have a lot of fun. We play soccer, play frisbee, and we even go swimming. But most, but most importantly, we get into the work. My question is, would you ever consider going on one of these trips with us? Uh, mission trips. Uh, I have always found a mission trip to be a great way for anyone to learn truly about their faith and what they believe and also to find out exactly um, where we fit in with the rest of the world. It's a big world out there and so I'm a big supporter of mission trips. I have been ever since I was in youth group and went on mission trips myself and so whatever way that I can support uh, the mission trips with the youth group, I am game for it. So let me know. Let's keep talking. I would love to get to participate with y'all and see how I can be of service to you guys as you serve other people. Hey Miriam, my name is Joe Sanders. I used to be in the youth group at Central, but now I volunteer. I do many things, help with lessons, lead small groups. One of the most fun is playing sports, like football with the youth. Hey Miriam, I'm Grayson Vermeer. I'm a part of the youth group too. Uh, my question for you is, would you be interested in leading a small group? Uh, and then small groups. Um, I love small groups. I love getting to work with uh, the confirmation class at my current church and uh, also at my church before that. It's always been a lot of fun, uh, in part because you guys have excellent questions and getting to uh, listen and learn as you are working out your faith is such a gift to me. Uh, yeah, so just consider me game so long as there's no tackle football uh, involved, please. That was my one request, I think. Do I get to make a request? And then there's Hoyt Condra. He goes on our trips with us and he helps us out with the youth a lot. He's there to talk with them and listen and also help lead small groups. We just love having him along. How you doing, Hoyt? <laughs> Just love Hoyt. He is our biggest fan. Anyway, thank you so much for answering our questions and listening to us, and we hope to see you really soon. Thanks. Um, thank you again, Rosie, uh, and Put, and Leah, and Joe, and Grayson, and Hoyt. That was a lot of fun. So, looking forward to seeing y'all in person. Bye.